Goodbye. Now let's switch to part two of our program today, rumor of the week. And the rumor of the week is quite bluntly, Joe Biden is losing it and losing it much more quickly than his backers had anticipated. Now let's be straight about it. Um, I, I came from the East Coast. I've known who Joe Biden was since he got in the Senate. Why? Because he's stupid. And he says a lot of stupid things. People think it's funny. I don't think it's funny. I didn't think it was funny when he was a, a freshman senator. And I really don't think it's funny today. I think it's sad. And in fact, some of the conservative commentators have even said, look, we don't take any joy in talking about the decline of a highly visible person, but especially someone who represents the free world, though that's going to be a moniker that I think is gonna go away with the crushing attack on free speech in the United States under the uh, Biden administration. But in any event, uh, let's, let's take a look at recent Biden history. And uh, here's somebody hid in the basement during the presidential campaign, famously, very, very little visibility. Uh, the couple presidential debates he did, famously, he slept all day, just showed up uh, for the debate, read off his cards, got softball questions. And then, gosh, at some point, somehow he got elected and uh, they inaugurated him and he has just gone downhill in a rather uh, disgraceful manner. And uh, I think that the fact that he has not scheduled a State of the Union speech is because he literally cannot stand there and speak for an hour without taking a break. The guy's not up to the job, and it is the responsibility of everyone who voted for this loser to take a look and say, this is what you've brought to America. And I think it's, it's a very unfortunately si unfortunate situation. Uh, what we're experiencing right now is his gaffes have gone from weekly to daily. Uh, yesterday, he could not remember the Secretary of Defense that he had just appointed, just appointed. A couple, day, a couple days earlier, he could not remember who he had nominated for another cabinet position, could not speak the person's name. This is a very serious situation. And the worst part about it is, who do we have behind Biden when the 25th Amendment is invoked? And we have a professed communist these days, although she wasn't in her earlier career. Uh, I call her Commie Harris. And that is not a move up for America. And I think America will be in deep trouble, worse than we are now, if, uh, if uh, Biden is replaced by Commie Harris. So this is a tough situation. I don't know when it's going to happen. I've been predicting it was gonna happen before the end of this term, this four year term, but I think it, uh, it could happen much uh, earlier. And that is the rumor for this week.